Hello, EW readers. My name is JD Pardo, and I play Easy Reyes on Mayans MC. And season three, we pick up with Easy uh, dealing with uh, the consequences of his actions, with uh, killing the killing of Dita, and how that's affected his relationship with his father Felipe. Um, there has been some distance there, and so now Easy finds himself. Um, a little bit on his own, but still with the support of his uh, his Mayan brothers because he is now a fully patched uh, Mayan. So he's settling into life. He's getting a little comfortable and exploring this new relationship with uh, with Gabby. Same question for you, Clayton. Come here. Hello, EW, my favorite people. My name is Clayton Cardenas. I play Angel Reyes, and we leave off heading into season three. We're seeing. We're seeing Angel deal with the loss of Adelita and his firstborn baby. Um, so, you know, now he's dealing with that and we see him bury himself with multiple women and alcohol. And he fully now is immersing himself in the club at the same time, trying to help guide his brother through this whole hierarchy of um, climbing the ranks of the MC. I'm a chismosa. I'm Latina. I'm here to talk about the love connections. All right. So Easy yeah. has uh, this this nice little relationship shaping out with Gabby. Uh, talk to me about that, JD. Yeah, you know, it's, it's, um, it's, 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 I think, refreshing. It's, it's a new uh, journey for Easy uh, now in season three, where he's really starting to put the past, uh, his past life behind him. Now that he's a, a full-fledged uh, Mayan, um, he's moving on from the, from the chapter of, of Emily. And he's exploring this relationship with Gabby. And what, what is exciting for me about that is that what you're seeing, you're seeing this, this relationship, this sort of dance between this man and this woman play out throughout the season. It, it also is a reflection of, of Easy's uh, romantic idea of love because he is a, a Mayan and he obviously has a lot of stuff going on from prison from um, a lot of his choices, you know, there's been this resentment, there's been this regret, there's been this um, sort of crisis of identity. Who am I really? Um, and did I cause it? You know, so there's a lot of, there are a lot, there are a lot of question, uh, questions that Easy still has, but you, see, you get to see now the effort of, of him trying to move forward. Um, and so he really takes on this, um, this dating relationship with Gabby. And, and uh, it, it, in, in, even though his intentions are pure, you start to see the conflict of him trying to pursue that. You know, it's, it's, um, it's almost like split personality. He's, he's, two diff he's, he's becoming two different people. There's the club and easy, and then there's how easy is with Gabby. And you get on, you become, you join the journey of, of easy trying to figure out um, how to navigate the two. I'm excited to see that duality from you because you can see early on in this season where uh, after the, you know, the Dita's death, he's really embraced becoming a part of the MC. Um, he had always been conflicted between those two worlds and now he's firmly in that space. And, yeah. but then you have Gabby who's so pure and I just keep saying, girl, he's fine, but run away. <laughs> <laughs> Well, at least he's fine, right? Um, I mean, I, I'm not sure if I said it, but Easy is fine. Uh, I, hey, thank you. Easy, easy loves it. Easy thanks you. <laughs> um, yeah, no, listen, I mean, I wouldn't, <laughs> you know, I don't think I'd want my daughter dating someone like Easy. You know, it's, it's, um, it, it's, but that's what's real about it, right? Is like sometimes these relationships come along and you want them to happen and, and they're not necessarily good for you. It's not to say that, you know, the person is really bad or we're really trying to judge that person, but um, I think that's what this is, right? It's, it's Gabby too has to decide and explore who she is um, in this. You know, sometimes um, uh, my mom would say love is not enough. Um, so I, I think that, um, boy, that's just like a sad, Latino thing to say, right? Like so morbid though. A broken heart. <laughs> My mom but says fall in love with your head and not your heart. But it's true. You right. know, 
you know, right? You know, it's it's true. It it happens in life. So um, I'm excited. I'm just excited to really play that out in this season. Like you said, it's refreshing to not be stuck in this place of do I want to be a part of the club? Do I not want to be a part of the club? You know, he's a club member. He's patched in. And now he's trying to figure out um, easy wants to get comfortable, but circumstances are going to come up, which which don't allow him to. Now, Clayton, you, you kind of tease a little bit about where um, Angel is going to be as far as uh, the complicated situation with Adelita. Can you talk a little bit about uh, whether or not they're going to reunite? And I also want to know how Angel is going to murder Potter. Um, well, you know what? I think ideally he has put that fantasy to bed. I think he, don't, he doesn't think he'll ever see her again, quite honestly. You know, and I think. And honestly, I don't think he thinks that she wants to see him. Uh, you know, I think she finds out that he actually had to make the decision between his father or her, and he chose his father. And she knows all the backstory about their relationship too. So I'm sure she feels even more scorned by that, that you act, you're choosing a man that never loved you. Here I am, I've told you I've loved you, and you're still gonna choose this man over me. You know, this father, this, this father that you hate so much. So, Heading into that, I don't think he 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 feels you ever see her again. I think he's put that fantasy in bed. I think he, you know, this this familial structure that he wanted, that he had um, envisioned that could pos that would possibly take him outside of the club, that dream doesn't exist anymore. You know, now it's uh he knows he feels he knows who he is. He's a uh, he's fully entrenched in the MC, willing to do whatever they want, and he's living that lifestyle. You know, it's a uh, in, in that type of lifestyle, there is a lot of women involved. And there's a lot of alcohol involved, Rosie, unfortunately. Well, Angel is so fine. I mean, what can he Not do? Not as fine as easy. I don't oh, know. Man, I, I, see don't know. I don't know. I'm here kind of know. equal. I see how I don't you know. Uh, you got you to choose. Like I was like the only one. You said like I was don't, like. Don't play both sides. See, this is why I don't like having fighting. everybody on We're one call have, because it ruins I'm my gonna, game. Uh,